Uh, Jack Rains, what made you decide to get a tattoo on your face? Was it drug related? I was fucked up on drugs. I don't know why I did it. Half, half don't even really remember doing it. Uh, Jeremy Keplinger heard a rumor that you intervened in a mugging slash rape in progress, stopped the situation, but got shot during the altercation. If the rumor is true, please elaborate on the situation. What happened? How did it happen? Uh, what were you thinking before, during, and after, etc.? Okay, I got, I did stumble up on two guys attacking a girl. Uh, I intervened, and uh, I didn't think anything before, before, you know, I just, I don't know, I just thought that was the thing. Where was this? It was in, uh, outside Atlanta. Okay. And I got shot here in the neck and here in the shoulder. I got, I'm missing my collarbone. There's a big hole there from yeah. where my collarbone used to be. And here I have a plates and screws in my neck. They did a pretty good job of plastic surgery. It's only a little scar Yeah, now. really, yeah. It used to be a big, giant thing, you know. But, uh, yeah, that was the beginning of the end, you know, like, uh, that's when I really started getting bad on drugs and stuff, too, because I couldn't hardly do anything. I was in a halo, my arm in a sling, you know, and just a pity party, felt bad for myself, probably, and mm -hmm. just hit it all in drugs. Now, uh, well, Calvin Hobbs from the board at F4W, when did you learn uh, to, where did you learn to no-sell bullets? Um, the, the shooting itself, they, uh, obviously you didn't know they had a gun when you happened upon them. No. You were able to get your hands on them. The yeah, girl, the kinda, girl goes. Yeah, the one guy was, see, it's kind of like I'm guessing I must have went in shock from everything. And you figured, so it's yeah. really kind of hazy. But one guy was on top of a gir the girl and the other guy behind him. And I pushed the pile and one guy ran and the other guy in my mind, because I, I thought he punched me, and I remember th that it hurt really bad, my eyes were watering, and then I felt like he punched me again, and I started to fall, and I used to have a knife, and I grabbed my knife, and I just lunged at him with my knife and stabbed him, and then, then the cops were there. It was that, it, by no, I didn't do it being tough, or I don't know how, I'm lucky that he didn't kill me. Mm. It, it, I remember kind of arguing with the cops, they're trying to get me in an ambulance and I was telling them I don't need to go to the hospital for being punched, because I didn't even really know what was going on, you know, and this was a Friday and I didn't really understand what happened until that Sunday. They had, a, my do, they had to fly my doctor in from Birmingham to do the surgery, because in my neck it would happen, all the, uh, Inflammation, it was crushing my spine. Wow. So, and they had to get a special doctor in to do the surgery. They couldn't, they didn't have somebody there in that hospital. So, it was a hair either way, I could have probably been dead. And uh, I had, <clears throat> wasn't that I was no selling the bullets, I just didn't even know. I'm sure if, if I would have thought he was shooting me, I would have probably been freaking out, you right. know. It just, everything kind of happened so fast. And from like shock, I, it's kind of a really, uh, blurry uh, memory for mm -hmm. me, you know? That's not shit. Uh, Michael Grote asks what I was going to ask. What happened to the guy that shot you? That you did stab him. Did they get him? Yeah, yeah. Okay. A Dizzle from the board at F4W Online. Some people say the story was made up. What's the story on that? Also, the, what was, was that the reason you missed Shane Douglas's uh, ECW? Well, I just saw the scars, so clearly it's not made up. Yeah, I got Either a big that hole. Or he, or he did big something hole here, to too. To cover for it, but uh, was that the reason you missed Shane's uh, ECW? I didn't. Show? I had no idea Shane had an okay. ECW show. Oh, uh, let's see. Uh, Don Tony from the Don Tony and Kevin Castle show back in April 2004. Frank Goodman and myself spoke to Perry Saturn, uh, which he told us exclusively he was shot three times, stopping a rape. That led to my infamous article that. Saturn no sold bullets. However, after researching this further, I accused him in December 2008 of possibly lying about the incident. I have in my possession court documents from his divorce, not to mention I spoke directly to his ex-wife. One thing that was given to me is that he was married one week after he claimed he was shot. To finally set the record straight, if he was shot, can he show us the scars he did? And I, and I don't know the who this bullets. person is. I never talked to anybody who said I was shot three times. I was shot twice. Right. Don't remember the Kevin Castle show? No, I have no idea who they are. Okay. Or who my ex-wife is, because my wife is dead. She died of a drug overdose. Right. Well, he, he, listen, he may be speaking to the dead. You never know. Uh, Jack Rains, what made you decide to get a tattoo on your face? Was it drug-related? I was fucked up on drugs. I don't know why I did it. Half, half don't even really remember doing it. Uh, 
Jeremy Keplinger heard a rumor that you intervened in a mugging slash rape in progress, stopped the situation, but got shot during the altercation. If the rumor is true, please elaborate on the situation. What happened? How did it happen? Uh, what were you thinking before, during, and after, etc.? Okay, I got, I did stumble up on two guys attacking a girl. Uh, I intervened and uh, I didn't think anything befo before, you know, I just, I don't know, I just thought that was the thing. Where was this? It was in, uh, outside Atlanta. Okay. And I got shot here in the neck and here in the shoulder. I got, I'm missing my collarbone. There's a big hole there from yeah. where my collarbone used to be. And here I have a plates and screws in my neck. They did a pretty good job of plastic surgery. It's only a little scar. Yeah, now. really? Yeah. It used to be a big, giant thing, you know. But, uh, yeah, that was the beginning of the end, you know, like, uh, that's when I really started getting bad on drugs and stuff, too, because I couldn't hardly do anything. I was in a halo, my arm in a sling, you know, and just a pity party, felt bad for myself, probably, and mm -hmm. just hit it all in drugs. Now, uh... Well, Calvin Hobbs from the board at F4W, when did you learn uh, to, n where did you learn to no-sell bullets? Um, the, the shooting itself, they, uh, obviously you didn't know they had a gun when you happened upon them. No. You were able to get your hands on them. The girl, yeah, the girl goes? Yeah, the one guy was, see, it's kind of like I'm guessing I must have went in shock from everything. So yeah. it's really kind of hazy.